face to face at last. It's high time we met. I'm quite pleased you were able to make it. The trip was not what I had intended, but serves as an adequate test of your abilities. What any good politician wants, your continued trust and support. In your case, however, I have more specific things to ask of you, if you'll hear me out. Our nation's capital is at a crossroads. The path that you and I choose here today will affect us all. I need you to act on my behalf to ensure that our country's future is secured. My abilities to influence the world are limited at this time. I alone can only do so much. You, however, may come and go as you please. You have a greater degree of freedom. Perhaps it's best if I explain why things need to change, and why I'd like you to act on my behalf. Our land is ravaged by mutation. The war was so many years ago, and yet we still suffer from its effects. We cannot move forward until humanity can gain a solid foothold in the world. To do so, we must rid ourselves of the mutations that have plagued us for so long. These Super mutants, ghouls, hideous creatures. I believe your father's work can do that in a way unlike any other. You must understand, we need to clear the way for humanity to rebuild the wastes. By making a few small modifications to the purifier your father worked on, mutations can be eradicated with a little effort. Anything mutated that comes into contact with that water will be eliminated, removed from the gene pool. The men and women of the world will no longer share it with the horrors and monstrosities that have become so commonplace. What I require of you is really very simple. There is a vial in front of you filled with a modified FEV virus. It needs to be inserted into the control console for the purifier. Once that is done and the activation code is entered, the purifier will be activated and the process will be automated. It's not too much to ask of you, is it? I find that unfortunate and most disappointing. I must impress upon you the severity of the situation. I cannot allow you to leave unless the vial is in your possession. And why would I do that when I'm clearly the best hope for the people of the wasteland? What alternative would you suggest? Without the enclave, what will the world do? Yes, I suppose it is. Very well. You shall have your wish. Once you've left, I'll put an end to the enclave. I cannot stop Colonel Autumn, however. That much will be up to you. I suppose, then, that this is goodbye. You'll have to see yourself out. I have preparations to make. <laughs>